Thank you for staying with us dito sa Men of Light, ang ating reflection from Luke 13, 1 to 9, our third Sunday reflection sa Lent, Why People Suffer. Yung ikatlong reflection natin ay ng posibilidad na hindi lang kahirapan dahil sa aksidente sa Siloam no? or dahil sa kasalanan ni Pilato. <laughs> Pwede rin po siguro yung suffering from the perspective of the gardener, the last part of the gospel. Yes. Mm-hmm. A gardener who was willing to wait mm-hmm. to to mercifully uh, yeah. uh, seek for chance no? yeah. and uh, another chance for the unproductive uh, fig tree. Yes. Uh, uh, parang that sense of compassion. No? Yeah. Parang to suffer with. And I, I think this is the a God who is like a gardener, not yeah. an owner. Di ba kanina may kinukwento kang perspective na... Ito yung tawag ko ho na eh, eh, yung element of surprise dito sa ating ebanghelyo. Yeah. <laughs> uh, apakalakas ho kasi nung tendency natin na pag binabasa natin yung talinghaga or parable, eh, ginagawa natin allegoria. Ang allegoria ho ay kakaiba sa parable. parable. Ang parable, isa lang yung sense niya, isa lang yung pinupunto niya. Pero, pag binasa mo bilang allegoria, parang gagawa ka ng one-on-one correspondence yeah, katulad yeah. nung ang, ang, the seed that fell on good soil, the seed that fell on rocky ground, the yeah, seed that fell on the thorns. Ano. Iba-iba yung meaning nun. Every element may meaning. Ganun, no? Ngayon, dito, Uh, kasi ho, may background na ito eh. Yeah, yeah. Parang, ang tagapakinig ng panahon ng Panginoong Heso Kristo, most likely, sabihin, narinig ko na yan. Kasi meron ding parable oh, yung there. Prophet oh. Isaiah tungkol sa isang fruitless vineyard. Parang, hmm. nagtanim yung amo ng ubasan, tapos, pagkatapos ng lahat ng pag-aaruga na ginawa niya hmm. sa kanyang ubasan, nagbunga ito ng maasim at mapaklang bunga. Hmm. Tapos, ano bang dapat gawin? dapat si Bakin. Parang gano'n. No? Well, here, parang habang nagkukwento ang Panginoon, parang conditioned ka na into believing that God is being associated with the owner of the orchard or the owner nung, nung uh, garden. Mm-hmm. Biglang magkakaroon ng shift, mag intervene ang isang gardener. Yeah. <laughs> and from the perspective of mercy, and he represents God. Yeah. Yes. So, parang the, the God figure here is not the owner, but The, the gardener, gardener who is merciful. Who is merciful. Yeah. Tapos nakikita niya, may dahilan kung bakit hindi nagbubunga yan. Yeah. Kaya give it another chance. Parang a God who stands in behalf of those who are not seen productive. That's mga, right. Di ba po ngayon parang, there are a lot of people like the fig tree na walang, walang kwenta. Mm-hmm. Kasi of our capitalist perspective na dapat mabunga ka, dapat productive ka, dapat may out put ka, di ba? You are only yeah. as good as your output. In a capitalistic mentality. Eh, paano kung, <laughs> kung hindi ka nag-aaral na mara, matas, hindi, yes. ka, hindi ka na malakas, Uh-oh. o matanda na tayo. Matanda so, na. We don't have the resources. Yes. Uh-huh. And uh, this is a God represented by the gardener who suffers with. Yes. Diba? Yeah. At saka, siguro, <laughs> ipasok ko lang, uh, Father Algin, yung, yung idea din na baka may circumstances bakit hindi siya yeah, makapagbunga. Yeah, yeah. And uh, you can also see the per- from another perspective, yung suffering noong fig tree. Yeah. Parang ganyan, no? Di ba kung minsan talagang kung kulang naman talaga yan sa pataba, kung kulang naman talaga sa dilig, kung kulang naman yes. sa araw yan, yeah, yeah. Eh, kahit na mabuting puno yan, hindi naman magbubuti yeah. na mabuting, bu- mabuting bunga. Yeah. yeah. Father Ako naman po, it's uh, my uh, personal conviction that the worst thing that can happen to a person is to be isolated mm-hmm. because God did not create us uh, to be alone. Uh, it's not good for a man to be alone yung, yeah. because we are basically social beings. Yes, so. And ve- every time we suffer, we, we feel alone, we feel mm-hmm. lonely. Mm-hmm. Parang, and uh, the best thing that can happen to you when you are suffering is to find someone, to have someone by your side yeah. kahit wala siyang maitutulong sa'yo na yung mm. talagang uh, physical na tulong, yung yeah. the fact na nandyan siya, kasama mo siya, suffering yeah. with you, mm. uh, that's already uh, malaking ano, bagay na yon para sa'yo yes. because you are yes. not alone. Yes. Yeah. Parang nagiging meaningful ngayon yung suffering na hindi lang suffering dahil masakit yung ngipin mo o suffering because nagkasakit ka may aksidente nangyari na nandyan na pero these are also sufferings because of the choice no? yes. may kasamang uh, human decision it yes. makes the suffering humane no? yeah. uh, suffering because of love yeah, yeah. yung parang mm. uh, 
nahirapan ka as a parents because you said yes. Eh. You yeah, said yes. I do. Eh. Yes. You embraced it. Eh. Mm-hmm. Tayo ring mga pare, we can be suffering also because we said yes. Mm-hmm. We embraced our own commitments, yeah. our yes. ordination natin, no? To love our church, our to be obedient to our bishop. Yes. And uh, all of these are out of choices. Yes. And this suffering, you could not blame God for that or even the mm. church or other people or it's natural. Yes. It's it's something that is out of human decision. Yes. Naalala ko yung isang ano yung yung isang uh, teacher na walang pamilya, dalaga. Tapos tinatawagan siyang loveless. Kasi <laughs> recent na walang love life yan kasi Valentine's walang walang kadate, walang nagte-text sa kanya, walang ayun pala kaya walang love life na sinasabi kasi umuwi siya ng maaga pagkatapos niyang nagturo kasi yung mother niya sa bahay na matanda na siya lang yung nag-aalaga tapos pag gumaga rin early morning ayusin yung mother niya bago niya iwanan pupunta na sa hospital ay sa sa skwelahan ang tanong doon hindi ba love yun no? yung, mm-hmm. and her suffering is not because she's a good, bad That's person right. or kasalanan niya yun or natural because she embraced Yes. Tuli may mga kapatid yung teacher na yon no na nasa Manila o nasa abroad. Pero parang her Binigay suffering niya. yung tinatag niya fruitful suffering. That's right. Hindi po suffering na walang kwenta eh parang mm-hmm. nagbubunga yung mm-hmm. tinatag ko minsan diyan eh, yung salvific no. Yes. It saves. Meron pong no? redemptive at salvific na kahirapan. Oh. May kahirapan na walang kwenta lang. Na nalasing ka na nauntog ka <laughs> pero yung Nag-suffer ka and somebody grew from that. That is salvific. Yeah. It is sacrifice na eh. Yes. Hindi suffering eh. Hindi Ay, lang pain yes. eh. So, It is sacrifice that is salvific. May bunga. At huwag niyo po pasayang, wag po tayong magpasayang sa mga suffering and pain natin that brings forth something good for another. Alam mo, so, Father Deo, unang pumasok yan sa kaisipan, sa, uh, sa Israelite faith, sa Old Testament, dun sa Book of the Prophet Isaiah, yung chapter 53, pinaka-pinaka- Uh, magandang passage in the book of Isaiah. Ito yung about redemptive suffering. Yung uh, the suffering servant. Yeah. By his suffering, my righteous servant shall justify the many. Yeah. Parang sa pamamagitan ng kanyang pagdurusa ay maraming ibang mga tao giginhawa. Yes. Parang ganyan. No? Amen. Actually, naalala ko po yung sinabi ni Father Deo kanina yung uh, yun nga yung only through, in love only Love can make pain and suffering bearable and meaningful. Mm. Okay, mm. Uh, pag nagbamahal ka, parang walang kwenta sa yung okay, pasan-pasan mo ba yung pamilya mo. Alam ng mga mother mo. siya. Yeah. 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 Ito yung tinatawag passion out of compassion. Yes. Yeah. Napaka-related ng two terms na yun. Kasi ang root word, ang passion, ibig sabihin, suffering. Yeah. No? Pero ang compassion is suffering with. Yes. Sometimes we suffer because we're suffering with. Yes, yeah. amen. At dito po talaga nagiging relevant and meaningful yung expression na acts of God. Yeah, oh, no. Dahil ito, ito talaga yung the act of God. The act of God seen in Jesus. Jesus suffered a lot. Mm. Even before He was crucified, He suffered a lot. But that is an act of the divine. He acted like the gardener. Yeah. And that suffering is out of His choice. Yeah. It's not an accident. It's not because it's so sin. Sabi nga, Jesus is with like us except sin. No? Yeah. But because he embraced the the cross out of love, and that suffering is not useless, but it's salvific. Yeah. Nagdala po ng kaligtasan sa ating lahat. Let's continue our prayer and reflection. Babalik po men of light for our greetings and our prayers. <music> 